Because when some people go camping and they have sleeping bags, and sleeping bags are really not that comfortable. If I could invent anything, I would invent a robot maid. So you wouldn't have to pay a roommate to make some do something for you. Well, I'd really like something to help cure cancer and um, maybe to stop war and something that would um, help the world be a better place. I would invent a car, as in like, like that floats. I'd invent something that would help the environment, like for factories, how they have smoke come up. What my adventure would be is um, clean dog poop up. I would invent a certain thing that blind people could use for um, like driving or whatever they would like to do. I would invent um, a microscope that you could see miles and miles away. I invented this laser transmitter because I felt like I didn't want to invent something like not another Apple creation or stuff like that. I felt like I should create something from my imagination and only my imagination. Like with a bus sleeper, you can just can carry it like in your pocket, shape shifted and all that. And it could be but layers of beds. And when you look up, there's like a fishing tank. And when you push a button, um, there's just layers of snacks and stuffed animals. I would invent a robot maybe because for people that is really lazy, they will want to, uh, they will have somebody to do it for them instead of them having to do it themselves. Because, like me, I like to sleep a lot instead of working on my homework and stuff. So when I'm at school, I get my homework done, but I have to go to homework detention to do it because I'm too lazy to do stuff. So I could have the robot made to do my homework for me and everything. And, like, it takes you to, uh, it uh, drives automatically, it gives you food when you, when it's like six and when you're feeling hungry. And it like takes you to sleep too. I'd make like a smoke screen that would um, that would take out the atoms of the smoke and make it into a cleaner kind of substance instead of hurting uh, the greenhouse effect. Why? Because because it's always a lot of dog food and you don't want to step in it. I would make something that they could use so it could help them to see, like, it would, like, if they were driving, like, they could, if they got in their car, then it would help them in their car, and, um, they, like, they would actually ask the car where they're going, and the car would probably take them there without them driving. Have you ever been camping and... Your sleeping bags always hit, feel sticks and stones. Well, come and buy my bus sleeper. Okay, here's another thing. I, it's called the car. It helps you relax. It got great seats, and it automatically drives by itself. So buy it. Are you way too excited, or are you really sad, or are you just plain old angry? Well, we've got the invention for you. It's a laser transmitter. The laser up top has an effect on the human brain, which will calm you down. If, if 
for some reason for anger, it doesn't work. That's what the goo is here for. The goo is like jello, but it can't break no matter how hard you try. So if you get really mad, you can just uh, squeeze it. And voila, there it is for the cheap price of only $75. Come and buy it at, at Best Buy and Ikea. Only at Best Buy and Ikea. Goodbye. Thank <music> you.